Welcome, thanks for joining. Today we are going to go through a simple date table in Power BI and specifically how to sort months uh, chronologically. So if we want to put in a month name, January through December, rather than putting in the month number, one through 12, what happens is when we try to sort by that column, it will sort alphabetically because a month name is a string field, it's a text field, not a number field. So there's a little workaround that we can use that allows us to still show those nice looking month names to kind of make your report look a bit more polished, but still be able to sort them chronologically. We have an associated blog with this video that you can see in the description below. Uh, and on that blog, you'll be able to see this exact code, which is what we're going to use to create a date table. Okay, so first we're gonna copy this code that you'll be able to find on our blog. We're going to go to modeling. We're gonna create a new table. And we're simply going to paste that code in here and we're gonna hit enter. And that is going to create this handy date table over here. We can hide that once we get it created, okay? Then on the report, I'm on a report page here that I've called date sorting. I'm going to create a table. For the sake of sanity, uh, for the style of the table, let's see, I'm gonna to go to general, just so that I can increase, I was looking for grid, but I can't do that until I have data in there. So I'm gonna drag in a month, name long okay that is in our table you can see that we've got a month name long field here whose format is mmmm that's going to be the full month name okay created a duplicate table here so i'm going to go in here you can see as discussed it's sorting april through September, those are the, it's, it's actually in alphabetical order, April, August, December. I joke with people, I mean, who wouldn't want dates sort that, sorted that way? It makes perfect sense. Of course it doesn't. So what we're going to do instead here is now we're going to highlight this field here, okay? So now all I've done is I've selected this field on the right side. I'm not clicking on the checkbox. I'm actually just clicking in the middle of the field, okay? So that it highlights it, okay? I'm going to go back to this visualization so it's selected. I'm going to check this here. And then I'm going to switch to the sort by column on the top. And instead, I'm going to sort by month number. And then what this is going to do is it's going to shift. You can close this so that you don't see that up there. And now you can see it's sorted January through December. Okay, you don't need to have that month number field in the visualization. You just need to change the properties of the sort by, which is in your columns tool on the panel up here on the ribbon, and switch to sort by and select month number in that date table that you've created. That's all. Good luck.